Yo, 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 what's up? It's your boy Mohawk Gas. Y'all tuned in to the Gas Podcast. Going after success. We got special invited guests in the building. Y'all go ahead and introduce, introduce yourself. Yo, this is your boy Draco. Coming straight out of 14. You know what time it is. That rat. Yeah, you know what time it is. Your boy, let's my 1800 shit. 14 circle, baby. We in the bed. You got the crew with you, man. Introduce the background oh, okay. players. Yeah, Get them, boy. boy. Tight shit, man. That's what it is. Ooh, nice. 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 Ooh, so he got locked up and shit. I told him about I was rapping and shit. He he said I could take the name, but just hold it down while he going and shit like that. And I've been running with it ever since. You know? Okay, so he still he's he still locked up. Yeah, he coming home this year though. Type shit in the summertime. All right. And he said Draco. So you representing Draco right now? As yeah. you, you took off and ran with it. For sure. Where you from for everybody who don't know where you from? No, I'm from. Everybody know where I'm from. At 18. What that mean? 1800. Ugly corn. What a nigga. What that cold spray? Like rat. 14, no. sir. Pumpin' old. Pumpin' old. Broward County. Okay, that part. Yeah. Uh, introduce yourself, fam. What it is. Yeah, no, I'm feeling this night. Shit, you know, I'm about 1800. All I'm raised around the snipers, you feel me? You look kind of young. How, how, how old it was when you started rapping? What I was? Oh, yeah. But I said I really like got focused and toured around like 15, 16. How old you was when you jumped off the porch? <laughs> a baby. <laughs> you still a baby. <laughs> <laughs> a baby. What, y'all, what single y'all pushing right now, though? Nah, I just, I'm about to drop a video called Save, and yeah, see me? That's what I'm pushing right now. And hey, what you pushing? Man? For the people that don't know, you feel me? I'm working on my album, Broken Promises. You know, about so, to be my second project release out there. Yeah. After Mixing Motions. But right now, I'm trying to push on Broken Promises. I'm going to get that out there for them. When that drop, the Broken Promises? I don't got a guaranteed due date right now, but sometime in February. How you came up with the name? February 14, you know, it's still a broken promise. Man, you too young to be knowing about broken promise. <laughs> <laughs> you know, broken promise yeah. too. Yeah, broken promise, you know me? How many tracks you got on there? You know, I'm finna put 14 on there. And I like to keep it between 18 and 14. I represent every weight anyway. Yeah. Any collabs with it? Any collabs? You no. Know, so far, I got Draco on it. And my dog right here, Do Say Dan. That's what I don't know. That's so far. I'm still trying to get a little couple more in there. Yeah. Okay. I seen you and Draco um earlier on the on the on the previous single. How y'all came about that one? Was that visionary? Yeah, that visionary. Oh no, it did be an energy thing. Yeah. You know I mean, like. Well, me and my brother going to try that energy collide with just that load that bit like that. <laughs> All of me. Yeah, man, that bit just, that energy, you know, we all came up on the same thing. Same way type shit, you feel me? So it just be the energy colliding on the beats and shit like that. And how'd y'all come up with that, um, the track, Visionary, like? Uh, nigga out here painting pictures, you feel yeah, me? Yeah, Visionary. Vividly. What that boy you actually say? Vividly, painting pictures vividly. Painting pictures actually. Where we spit that bit, you gonna picture it in your mind. You yeah. know what we talking about. Okay, that, that part. And um, uh, Draco, do you got a um, mixtape you working on? <laughs> nah, I ain't gonna lie. I, I wasn't working on no mixtape, but I've been thinking like my next mixtape finna be like 
straight trappers only type shit, like straight dope boys and shit like that. You feel me? Niggas that never even rapped before finna be on that bit. Nah, you got straight street niggas. Yeah. Features. Yeah. What they gonna be doing though if they ain't What? In the video? Nah. We finna bruh. Change the game. Yeah, we finna I'm finna try to see some. All that. All that. Straight dope boys. Niggas you never seen rap before, no none. Surprise out here with yeah. Growing up, what was like um growing up in the neighborhood, eighteen hundred? Shit crazy. For real. But that shit get real like, but you just gotta stay ten toes, you feel me? That's all it is, you keep your head up, go fold, and you gonna make it through that. Right. Grind, get money, you gonna make it through that. So, um, y'all moved, or you, or you was born in Golden Lake, is eighteen hundred. I was, man, I was born, born in that bitch. Enjoying, yeah, we craw- crawling in that bitch. That shit like that. I mean, ain't no moving in. But yeah, ain't no moving in. Ain't no shit like that. Born in that shit. You know what I mean? Right about state project yeah. So what was like a, a influence of you starting to rap, both of y'all? Like I know eighteen hundred called that black um from around that area. Um did you guys ever meet him or or talk to him? Looked up to him and while he was growing up in the game? Yeah, for sure. But ain't gonna lie. He ain't really influenced me to rap. That boy Lil Snipe influenced me to rap. I ain't gonna cap. The snap influence me to rap. So he was rapping first? Yeah, he was rapping first. He made his song called Foreign. <laughs> <laughs> he made it off his phone too, like, that built hard, though. You feel me? I ain't gonna lie, and I, and I was fucking with that shit, so. What was it about that song? Was it how, how he, he delivered it or his lyrics that caught your attention? It was like, damn, he snapped. It's really everything, and plus he did it off his phone, like, you know? Like, you don't see, like, you don't, come on, like. It can't long with him, the rap mean, He did it off his phone, in his closet type of shit, like. Uh, but going back to that era, on that, on what were you thinking when you were coming up with that? I was thinking, I ain't gonna lie, it was just one in the thing I thought about, I just, like, did it. They know I could do it, so I just tried something for me to carry it out. Like, okay, you can do it for real. All right. When you usually go in the studio, do you freestyle, jot it down, write it down? How you come up with your lyrics? Most of my lyrics, I write them things down. I like to get in there. But sometimes I'm in the studio, I'll probably go in there and freestyle something. But if I don't got something fully written, I'll freestyle the rest of it in there. All right, Valentine's, February, I forgot when it is. Nah, we back to that other question, though. Yeah, like, but that boy, yeah, like, he put the bigger picture in the nigga head, like, it's more shit to it, like, you feel me? As far as? As far as the music shit in the world type of shit, like, I ain't even lying, like, people, come on, like, 15, 12 year old, yeah, cool, like, a nigga really could. Like somebody you know made it out. Yeah, like yeah. it's like when your homeboys going to the lead, you like, yeah, shit, like, yeah, yeah, that's yeah, us. Like, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Bit motion, heavy motion. The Z dance, Z dance coming up. Y'all boys going prom? Well, y'all still young. Y'all still in school, so y'all can go to your own prom. You ain't got to. Yeah. I, go I ain't never go to prom. Yeah, I ain't go to prom. But I ain't go to prom because Corona came. They, they canceled everything for my year type of shit. Yeah, so what kind of effect do you think that Corona came up on, on like, your schooling, the, the rap game? What changed before the Corona and after the Corona for you? Damn, I don't really know. Ain't, ain't shit really changed. Like, the motion, the motion was different. Everybody was 
on the phone in the house. You really couldn't connect with people how you usually connect. So everything went more digital. Ooh, still out here on Chrome, man. Oh, Lord, yeah. <laughs> oh, Lord, everything was still yeah, again, man. man. That big J, you feel me? It eat. just separated us yeah, inside of right, the outside yeah. of the Who's going to stay inside? Bro, they ain't stopping shit. I'm going to keep it going. So, um, how did y'all hook up, though? You and Draco. Uh, uh. We played on the same basketball team, went to the same schools. What schools you went to? Markham. Crystal Lake, Ely. Ely. You know, that's just a go naked yeah, thing. You live a go naked. That's, that's three schools you're going three to. Schools. Boston, Crystal Lake, and Ely. Okay, okay. Three step what sports did y'all play together? See, we only played basketball. basketball. Yeah. Basketball. Play for GA. Yeah. You play for GA. Everything GA. Everything. Everything. GA. So y'all GA project babies for real. Yeah. Baby if, Snipe. Oh, GA, <laughs> baby Snipe. If y'all wasn't rapping, what would you be doing? Hmm. I wasn't rapping. That yeah, part. <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. Say less. Say less. Say less. So as far as the um the single right now, like um where do you see it going that you 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 pushing? I ain't gonna lie for now. I ain't gonna lie for now. Promote my next video, the save video. That's what I'm about to drop. It's saved. Yeah, save. What made you come up with that title? <laughs> Cause like a lot of niggas been saved. Yeah, a lot of niggas been saved and shit like that. You know what I mean? When you mean save, what was what exactly does that mean? Like, like save, like you spare them. Nah, just save, like save, like. <laughs> I mean, you, it, it's a couple different ways <laughs> you can take save now. Save, save, just save. Yeah. Well, give us a verse of that. What's what what's the hardest verse you got on that? The whole thing. Yeah, the whole thing. I said, God saved some niggas, but he took a couple niggas too. I've been on I've been on this grind, got me belly hand to the booth. You feel me? Okay. I ain't gonna that so shit save, hard, though. Save. You got that boy a little, little snipe on it yet or nah? He coming on the remix. I got snipe on so much shit. Me and Snack could drop a collab, take 18 songs straight. Back to back bangers. So what's up? What, what's up? What you waiting on then? Run it. We want to hear it. We just it take time. You feel me? Shit take time. Yeah, we drop that thing. Just know that it hook like fiends. Yeah, that be coming for sure. That be coming. And snipe. What um. On your on your album, what's one of the verses? One of one of your hottest verses? So many on. I got it. Every song got hard ass verses, so I would be bullshitting if I say if I choose one. You feel me? How about your song? What's your favorite <clears throat> song on that? It's the same thing. <laughs> you got a lot of bangs. Up to the fans, you feel me? Man, I got number heat. Only made what song on YouTube that you had that did the most numbers? Right now, yeah. Me and my dog, Draco 1800, RKO. RKO? Yeah. What does that stand for, RKO? Randy King or. <laughs> 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 you know the little rest a little on the flat down, whatever. Yeah. Yeah, you know. Yeah, that's it. Randy Orton. Big name Randy King or what? Yeah, for sure. RKO. RKO. And what made y'all come up with that? With that title? What What, we, uh, what vibe y'all was on? <laughs> Who came up with it? Yeah, I did it. That boy, that boy showed me the hook. I, I gotta hop on that. 
It was on lean and shit like that. <laughs> it, was, it was a vibe. Yeah, it was on shit like that. I don't know. Yeah, I, yeah that's that's the video I was watching. It was doing numbers, numbers. Yeah, that shit did numbers, though. Did y'all think it was going to do numbers like that? Or you just put it out there just to see what it'll do? We were really like testing out some cameraman when we did Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were testing out we the cameraman. Yeah. So we were testing out and just threw it out there. Oh, hey, what? Jolo, what, what nah, was it? Nah, Rosil. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> you, you, you been shooting a, a, a lot of videos for y'all? Yeah. Yeah, it's like one of my videos. Then they all my videos. And how y'all hooked up with him? I met them through the <laughs> Them, boy, them boys, them boys went to this. Them boys went to Ely with me, and them boys heard I rap and shit. But them boys was always like, "Oh yeah, bro, I shoot videos. Let me, let me shoot one of your videos and shit." And yeah, them boys shot that bit. Yeah, them boys shot that bit. They ripped it too. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah, they ripped that bit. And what made you get them that? The, the the chance cause I ain't gonna lie I ain't never shoot a video at that time I ain't even never shot a video so that was your first video yeah who set it up did, did you um tell them how you wanted it or they just listened to the song and came up with like an idea no, for I like on some shit like I don't remember they wanted to shoot a video, video. I told them to shoot that song we was chilling in the hood they pulled up, we hit the bando. Shot that in the hood, you feel me? But y'all had the key for the bando? Yeah. Nah. Yeah. Right. Fuck. <laughs> 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 That's why I left the door open? Nah, we shot nah, it in front of the bando. Oh, okay. So, bandos, is there a lot of bandos around there? Yeah, yeah. Or is it just that one bando? Nah, there's a lot of bandos. Yeah, but that, that bando we had wrote on the we had wrote on the um the wood type of shit. So and then you feel me? That would be a good scene for a video. Oh, so y'all basically marked the territory. Type of shit, yeah. <laughs> it came out clean though. It came out clean. But I had to retest them again when I shot the nocturnal with them. Not like that boy weed. That nocturnal was doing doing numbers too. I was watching that. What made you um, cause come up with that? Nocturnal. Yeah, late at night, I was in the pool, shit. I wrote a song, bitch. Yeah. Just thinking about it, I don't be sleeping. But nocturnal, you know, the fun start at night, you know what I mean? Yeah, what's the latest you been up? You look like you you too young <laughs> to be up, man. What's the latest you been up? You been I watched the sunrise. Too young, man. I watched the sunrise. <laughs> How long y'all be in the studio for? As long as I've been in the studio for six hours. Just to lock in and what's the most songs you ever did while you in the studio? I made eleven songs in three hours. Eleven songs in three hours? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's a grind. That's that's that boy did that. Yeah, that's that's discipline. Yeah, yeah. Right there, lock yourself in the studio. Did you have a deadline to meet, or you you just was in that vibe? I was just in that vibe. I said, "Fuck it, dude. went to the studio." I ain't, I ain't really know I was doing that much until they told me like, well, you, "That's five songs in an hour. That's that's my way I'm fucking to get with me." I did. And uh, Draco, what's um the most songs you ever did in a session? I ain't gonna lie, I ain't never did no shit like that, <laughs> But in an hour, I be making like three songs in an hour. Okay. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. So, getting on, getting on. Appreciate you fellas for coming through the podcast. Guys, going after success. Let everybody know what y'all represent and um, what y'all got coming up. Where to find you and how to find you. And then we'll, we'll run it. I represent 1800 Block. Ugly corner. Fourteen circles. <laughs> baby snipes on oh, the week. Baby snipes. 
Yeah. Broken My. promises on the way. Yeah, yeah. Type shit. Stay tuned. Stay save video. Too, that yeah, part. That part. Yo. Yo. Gleefully. <laughs>